amarata is for sexual vitality and fertility. Now, don't run away, don't fast forward just yet. <laughs> because it isn't taboo for us to look at our reproductive energies. This is why when our body produces the right ratios of the reproductive hormones, a little bit more testosterone for men, a little bit more progesterone for women, the body recognizes itself as a viable reproductive vehicle, and then hormones will start to be synthesized that are good for the skin, like superoxide dismutase, or SOD, which is a wonderful anti-aging hormone. You see, when we go to the sexual energies, it's the quickest way to fast track our youthfulness and revitalization. We can certainly burn ourselves out using sexual energies wrong. And Mantok Chia and other people have books on the cultivation and how to share those powerful energies with your loved one. But don't run away from the idea of fortifying that base chakra energy, male and the female gonads. And that's one of the fastest ways to see your youth coming back. Amarato includes Sistanch, a wonderful Yang Jing herb taken throughout history and renowned by all of the emperors and men and women of ancient China for helping assist with reproductive potency. And then Epimidium, and that's known as the horny goat weed. <laughs> and it got this name because in the ancient times, goat herders would find that their goats would eat the leaves from this plant just before going into their mating season. And so it was referred to as horny goat weed. But this is a wonderful herb for overall health. Amarata. A great formula for all people, for their growth and their strength. All right.